Philanthasy, Wikipedia article audio. See text. Description. Philanthasy is a family of flowering plants in the Uticot order Malpigiales. It is most closely related to the family Picrodendraceae. The Philanthaceae are most numerous in the tropics, with many in the south temperate zone, and a few ranging as far north as the middle of the north temperate zone. Taxonomy Some species of Andracne, Antidesma, Margaritaria, and Philanthus are in cultivation. A few species of Antidesma, Bacchaurea, Philanthus, and Euapica bear edible fruit. History Philanthaceae comprises about 2,000 species. Depending on the author, these are grouped into 54 to 60 genera. Some of the genera are poorly defined, and the number of genera in the family is likely to change as the classification is further refined. The genus Philanthus, one of the largest genera of flowering plants, with over 1,200 species, has more than half of the species in the family. Classification Some of the genera have recently been sunk into others, while other genera have recently been divided. The largest genera and the approximate number of species in each are, Philanthus, Cleistanthus, Antidesma, Aporosa, Euapica, Bacchaurea, and Bridelia. Genera Since Philanthaceae was revised in 2006, one paper has removed Heterosavia from Savia. Another has separated Notoleptopus from Leptopus, and segregated Pseudophilanthus and Philanthopsis from Andracne. Also, Oreoparanthera has been subsumed into Paranthera, while Tsimmermania and Tsimmermaniopsis have been sunk into Manechia. The large genus Cleistanthus is known to be polyphyletic, but further studies will be needed before it can be revised. Phylogeny The description here is from Hoffman, except for a few additions from Webster and Hutchinson where cited. Philanthaceae is an unusually diverse family for its moderate size. It can be recognized only by a combination of characters because there are a few exceptions to almost everything that is generally true of the family. It is most notable for having two ovules in each locule of the ovary, a trait that clearly distinguishes it from Euphorbiaceae. The Philanthaceae are nearly all trees, shrubs, or herbs. A few are climbers, or succulents, and one species, Philanthus fluitans, is aquatic. Unlike many of the Euphorbiaceae, none have latex, and only a very few produce a resinous exudate. Any hairs, if present, are almost always simple. Rarely are they branched or scale-like. Thorns and other armament are rare. Stipules are produced with each leaf, but in some, these fall before the leaf is fully mature. Leaves are present, except for a few species of philanthus that have flattened, leaf-like stems called cladodes that bear flowers along their edges. The leaves are compound in Biscophia but otherwise simple and usually alternate. Rarely are they opposite, in fascicles, or in whorls around the stem. The leaf margin is almost always entire, rarely toothed. A petiole is nearly always present, often with a pulvinus at its base. The inflorescences are usually in the axils of leaves, rarely below the leaves or at the ends of stems. In Euapica, the flowers are in a pseudonym, a tight bundle of flowers that resembles a single flower. Except for four species of Aporosa, the flowers are unisexual, the plants being either monoecious or dioecious. The flowers are actinomorphic in form. 
Detailed illustrations have been published for some of these. The sepals are 3 to 8 in number, usually free from each other. Petals may be absent or present. If present, there are usually 4 to 6, and their color is yellow to green, or rarely, pink or maroon. A nectary disc is often present. It may be in the form of a ring, or divided into segments. The stamens are 3 to 10 in number, or rarely more, free, or variously fused. The ovary is superior. The number of locules in the ovary is highly variable, usually from 2 to 5, but sometimes as many as 15. The placentation is apical, with a pair of ovules hanging by their funicles from the top of each locule. Often, only one of the ovules will develop into a seed. A single, massive obturator may cover the micropiles of both ovules, or each ovule may have its own thin obturator. The megagametophyte is of the polygonum type. The style is usually two-lobed or bifid, sometimes entire or rarely multifid. The fruit is a schizocarp, droop, or berry. In some, the schizocarp breaks up explosively. The name Philanthaceae was first validly published by Ivan Ivanovich Martinov in 1820 in a Russian book entitled Technobotanico Slovar. A proposal to conserve this name was published in 2007. Martinov's name was rarely used in the 180 years after he published it. During that time, the plants that are now in Philanthaceae were placed in the large and heterogeneous family Euphorbiaceae. The monophyly of Euphorbiaceae had long been held in doubt by some, but the first strong evidence of its polyphily came in 1993 with the first maximum parsimony analysis of DNA sequences of the gene RBCL from a large number of seed plants. Since the 1993 study, all subsequent phylogenetic analyses have shown that the old concept of Euphorbiaceae consisted of several lineages that did not together form a clade in the order Malpigiales. Euphorbiaceae is now defined as a much smaller family than it had been in the 20th century. Pandaceae, Philanthaceae, Picrodendraceae, Putrangivaceae, Puraceae, and Centroplacaceae have been removed from it. The obsolete, older concept of Euphorbiaceae, known as Euphorbiaceae sensolato, is sometimes still used for continuity and convenience. It was the subject of a book and two papers which stood as the standard works on Philanthaceae until that family was revised by Hoffman and CO authors in 2006. In the past, the genera Centroplacus, Paradrupetes, and Philano had been placed in Philanthaceae, but these are now excluded from the family. Centroplacus is now in the family Centroplacaceae. Paradrupetes is in Rhizophoraceae. Philano is known only from a single specimen. In 1996, this was examined and found to be a species of Renoria. The family Philanthaceae is divided into two subfamilies, Antidesmatoidae and Philanthoidea. Antidesmatoidae is divided into six tribes and Philanthoidea is divided into four. The tribe Antidesmata of Antidesmatoidae, and the tribes Bridleia and Wielandiaea of Philanthoidea are further divided into sub-tribes. The following classification table is from the 2006 revision of Philanthaceae. In Certicetes, Chonocentrum. Subfamily Antidesmatoidae Six Tribes. Subfamily Philanthoidea Four Tribes The list of 54 genera below is from the 2006 revision of Philanthaceae by Petra Hoffman and co-workers. 
In their treatment, Blosha and Petalodiscus were sunk into Wielandia and Richariella into Fluegia, while Brenia, Glocidian, Riverconia, and Soropus were subsumed into Philanthus. Genera previously considered as the tribe Drypatia are now placed in the separate family Putrangivaceae. The revision of Philanthaceae by Hoffman and CO authors was based on two molecular phylogenetic studies that were published in 2005. Since the revision, phylogenetic studies have been done on some of the tribes. The phylogenetic tree shown below is based on the results of several studies. 51 genera are represented. Chonocentrum and three members of the tribe Spia have not yet been sampled for DNA. Chonocentrum is known from only a single specimen collected in the 1850s. In the phylogeny shown below, statistical support for the clades was measured by bootstrap percentage. All branches shown below have maximum parsimony bootstrap support of at least 70%. Biscophia Euapica Spondianthus Protomagabaria Richeria Aporosa Mysobotria Bacchuria Jablonskia Kellyanella Hieronema Leptonema Martresha Apodiscus Hymenocardia Didymocystis Thecacorus Antidesma Securinigia Lachnostylus Gonatogyne Savia Tacarcuna Discocarpus Croizacea Cleistanthus Pseudolachnostylus Pentabrachin Bridelia Chiodendron Aminoa Plagiocladus Margaritaria Lingelchymia Heterosavia Fluegia Philanthus Haywoodia, Chascothica, Astrocasia, Wielandia, Dicolia, Corizandrachne, Andrachne, Manechia, Notoleptopus, Pseudophilanthus, Perinthera, Philanthopsis, Actephala Leptopus